they'll get the benefit of last line change for those first two games. Uh, is it important to, to match up defensively against the Bergeron line, or do you like this club's depth in terms of being able to handle them and maybe contain them as best uh, as they can? Well, you're not always going to get uh, the matchup game 100%, uh, whether you're at home or on the road. So obviously, uh, when you're on the road, uh, uh, even more so. So, you know, you need uh, four lines that uh, uh, to obviously go out there and be reliable uh, in all three zones. And um, to get to this point of the year, you've had contributions throughout your lineup, and you need that to continue if you want to uh, uh, play long and into the into uh, the spring and go deep in the playoffs. So uh, no question uh, that line is very dangerous, uh, one of the best in the league, uh, one of the most productive. So got to be aware when they're out there and got to do a good job against them. Um, but uh, we, we've had a pretty good season on the road, and, you know, we've, we've played some good hockey uh, away from uh, away from T.O., so uh, just want to continue that and, and find that kind of rhythm uh, that we've had there, and, and uh, hopefully that leads to some success. Watching the Tampa game in Boston last week and uh, their ability to, to stretch Boston out, certainly not easy. Obviously, this team and the skill set it has, uh, is it, you think, capable? And is that a, a proper way of perhaps getting successful and uh, maybe getting a split in Boston? Yeah, I think uh, um, certainly uh, the way Tampa is able to spread teams out, even uh, uh, very uh, well-structured, uh, uh, well-disciplined team, uh, the way Boston is and how well, how well they play uh, uh, with and without the puck. So, you know, certainly I think uh, with our ability to create opportunities and uh, uh, you know, be able to use time and space. I think that's the biggest thing is uh, you have to go out there and earn every 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 inch, every foot of ice you can get, and, and the more you can get, obviously, uh, I like uh, our ability to make plays uh, with that with uh, with that opportunity. So, obviously, you want to try to get them uh, uh, outside of their comfort zone, uh, be able to to uh, uh, manipulate uh, 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 the opponent, and, and have some good time and space to be able to make some plays, and, and obviously uh, put the puck in the net. Uh, beyond your veteran expertise, you look across this dressing room, you see Ron Hainsey and Jake Muzzin, both players of one Stanley Cups. Uh, can you put a value figure on what they mean? It's hard. Uh, you, you really can at times. I think uh, just the way they, they handle adversity, uh, you know, when you go through things uh, and, and just uh, uh, the manner in which they do it, how they carry themselves, how they react to certain things. Uh, some things that kind of uh, get a lot of attention but really don't mean a whole lot when it actually comes down to it. So, um, yeah, their leadership's key, uh, and it's great to have those guys around, not just uh, for what they do for us on the ice but in the locker room and, uh, you know, how they able to dictate a lot of things uh, with just the things they've been through.